Hi everyone, Comic Reviewer here. This time we're reviewing on <clears throat> Green Arrow DC Rebirth issue number one. Now, as you know, DC Rebirth was basically DC's way of adding in old elements into their new universe. And the cover you have Green Arrow getting ready and his and the characters he's met over the years, despite the wild dogs not appearing in this issue. And it starts off how how in Seattle docks a workers looking on saying, God forgive me. And you see these people being in in homeless people and other things. And they're like, there's something about the fog in the sea. It makes people think that they're in invisible. And that they can't get away with anything. And so you've got Green Arrow and Black Canary saying, but you can't hide from Green Arrow and Black Canary. Now, I actually do admit, I actually like Black Canary's new outfit. It kind of gives a kind of badass punk girl feel. And so they, Green Arrow gets his arrow shot ready, and Black Canary had to take on the enemies. Well, Green Arrow's friend, Henry, is mainly on the computer analysing the battle. Yeah, he's kind of like the comic book version of Felicity Smoke, saying, Just to show you how I go the extra mile, despite being overworked and, un and underpaid, I've hacked the, the port surveillance cams, and I'm afraid you've got more baddies headed your way. Head up east, man. And so you've got Omiko, who is Green Arrow's half-sister, saying, <clears throat> Try to save me, and you'll bleed, because I'm a weapon. So this is as one of the main villains tries to threaten a kid. One of the arrows is fired by Green Arrow, and they're like, How you doing, Army? I was raised by a supervillain, and my mum is a ninja. How do you think I did? And so together they pretty much take on the threat. And afterwards the police show up and Green Arrow gives them intel and such. And says, happy to ask around, assuming. Remember, we both work for good for the city. And so afterwards Green Arrow confronts the man saying, because I'm double it. You work for me now. Anything that happens off the book, I know about before it happens. And Black Canary's like, are you insane? You paid off the cops? Now that scumbag, he should be going to prison for the rest of his life. And Green Arrow says that not all people are evil. It's just how things are. <clears throat> and so, in the morning, Green Arrow and Black Canary get ready. And after get after pretty much much Black Canary singing a song to Armico, the team Green Arrow and Black Canary get ready to show him around, showing him areas like the homeless shelter, the hospitals, the the public parks, the the Fresh Start Home, which is a women's refuge, <clears throat> and just, and pretty much Black Canary's like, I don't doubt your good intentions, Ollie, but do you realize that your relationship with Ami is the only one in your life that isn't based on money? That's not true. I've got Henry. He works for you. And so, after getting into a discussion, Black Canary leaves, and you have, like, Oliver thinking, okay, this could have gone better. I'm trying to show the world I'm a better person now. And after going into his company, and even talking with the guys who's now in charge, and so it turns out that he may be working with the bad guys saying, it's him, it's time. And so... Pretty much, Oliver goes into his room, house, ends up getting fired by arrows, saying, No! And afterwards, it turns out that the 
that the person Ollie's who's taken over his company for him is actually a villain and Oliver ends up getting fired by arrows and he's like shadow and he's like I hoped this day would never come Queen is a fool but a valuable one he's been an unknown absent to us all these years a totem for the business we need to handle this carefully having Shadow kill him is a solution and so Oliver tells Omni to get out of, out of the house but he ends up firing an arrow at him and Omni's only response is where have you been mother I've been waiting f such a long time so yeah the story is actually pretty good. It builds up some suspense. We see Oliver Queen trying to be be a better person and trying to make his life better. So I give the comic a good thumbs up. Still good and still right. So comic reviewer here, signing out.